Damn. A lot of shit. <laughs> hey, what is up, YouTube? Dean here. Welcome to DJ TV. It's uh, this short for Dean Joseph Toy Vlogs. Uh, in yesterday's video, some of you guys did like the intro, which I'm not gonna really keep it. I'm gonna change it up time to time. So yeah, <laughs> but I appreciate you guys liking it though. And I just want to talk about uh, a comment that I had yesterday. Somebody was telling me that we're gonna get serious for a second, guys. Let me put you guys down real quick. Let's get serious real quick. All right, I had a comment yesterday. Uh, if I forgot your name, I'm sorry. Um, I got a comment of somebody saying that they don't want to go to school tomorrow because they're scared of being bullied one of my subscribers one of my viewers is being bullied in school i i even commented to him i said no no matter what happens you know those bullies are going to get theirs at the end guaranteed when i mean by that something bad is going to come back to them um you know Go tell somebody. Go tell your counselor. Go tell your teacher. Go tell your principal. Anybody. They will help you. This time of year. Well, I shouldn't say this time of year. But in school, like, now they have stuff where they deal with bullies. And they just, like, try to get these bullies away. Which I think is fantastic. I've been reading a lot of stuff about this before. Because, believe it or not, I, of course, I have been bullied in the school all the time. It was like a non-stop thing. It was so annoying. Uh, some things I really didn't do much about it. Because, like, you know what? I don't care what they say about me. As long as you never lay the hands on me, we were good. You know, you could say I'm fat. You could say I'm ugly. You could say, you could say whatever. First of all, I'm not fat, I'm fluffy. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm losing the weight because I want to do it. Uh, not just because somebody's telling me to do it, you know. Uh, bullies are bullies. If somebody is bullying, bullying you, go tell somebody right away so they could bring the bully down and stop the bulliness for your guy's safety and... To make your life better. Because I know when it comes to bullies. I've read stories that I wish I have never read. Or even heard. Um, like people commit suicide. It's no joke when it comes to bullies. People commit suicide over it. People start rumors about you that's not even true. Or there's something that is true. That a secret that got out. That you did not want it to be out. And, like I said, just tell somebody right away. Don't keep it stuck inside you. Because there are people that I do know that does keep it inside them. And they're hurt inside. But sometimes they don't show it on the outside. And I like helping people. You know, it, it, with my channel, I know I make some people laugh. I make some people smile. That is 100% one of my favorite goals for YouTube, for my videos. I make somebody smile. Uh, that's like the best medicine ever. Guaranteed. You know, that comment really did touch me yesterday. It is a pinned comment. Uh, and shout out to uh, the guy that wanted to be pinned. He was the first comment guy. But he said, give the pinned comment to the guy that was being bullied. And I respect that so much. I did. So I like both of their comments. And it was. That's amazing right there. That proves that there is still love in this world. That's what we need. Um, bullying is a huge thing. You know. It, sometimes it leads to suicide. Which I hate seeing that. There was a girl in my old high school. Who committed suicide over bullying. People cut themselves. It's, it's just not worth it. You know, your life is worth everything. Guaranteed. Uh, even have a guy 
come to my high school one day and all of us sat down in the auditorium. The guy came up on stage and talked about his son. I think his son, I think he said his son was seven or nine years old. And it, I know it touched a lot of people. Uh, his son died over bullying. He committed suicide. And it was one of his best friends that technically turned heel on him. And I just hate that stuff. I really do. So if I ever see bullying around me, I legit would step in and stop it. But, you know, that's the thing. Another thing with New York, it's really tough to see it. But I know other places, there's bullying still happening, which I wish I can stop. But the best advice I could give is just tell somebody right away, and I'm pretty sure they will help. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, I just wanted to take this time, you know, six minutes and just talk about it because it is a serious thing that is going on. And it, it just touches me. It really does. This is one of the things that really touches me. And, you know, it, it's just one of those things. <laughs> so let me just move you guys a little bit. Cool. So I just wanted to talk about WrestleMania real quick. I know I wasted so much time talking about that, which was really important. And I hope you guys follow up with that as well. Um... I was going to talk about WrestleMania plans uh, coming soon. Let me pick up my belt here. Oh, and remember, if you're being bullied, always remember, at the end, you're still the champ. You're still the champ. Remember that. No matter what happens, you will always be the champ. Throw that to a sweet sign up. <laughs> uh, WrestleMania. I'm excited. I can't wait. Um, plans are... I will definitely be hanging out with Christian, Unstable 10. Something. <laughs> I can't get the last two numbers right. But I will be with his family during the weekend. We're going to have a great time. Great vlogs. Great videos. We're going to do everything together. We're going to go get fat. <laughs> you know, I can't wait for that. Um, I don't know. I don't know what to say. I'm going to leave on a Thursday in March. The last Thursday in March. Fly out. Hang out with my sister. And just see my family out there for a little bit. Then Friday, of course. Come Saturday. Go meet up with Christian. Sunday, WrestleMania. And... I don't know, maybe. I'm thinking about going to Monday Night Raw after WrestleMania. That's for sure. I am actually going to go to Monday Night Raw on March 20th, I believe it is. Two weeks before WrestleMania. It's going to be at the Barclays Center. And I think I will be there with Julian. Uh, Julian, if you're watching, uh, I am down, bro. I am bringing the title. We're going to go Shake Shack. <laughs> it's going to be a great time. So, yeah. <laughs> so, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Uh, like, I hope you guys follow what I say before. Like I said about bullies. Um, you know, it's just a huge thing. And I hope that you guys could help out as well. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. What am I doing? Oh, the Super Bowl is today. Woo! <laughs> Let's go Falcons. I'm sorry for the Patriots fans. But I'll see you guys tomorrow.